In this video, I'll be talking about the expectation versus reality of owning rats as pets. First of all, shout out to Live Laugh Birds for suggesting this video. Please go over to their channel and say hi. So hopefully this video will show you what it's like to own rats and might help you with the decision to keep them as pets. Rats are really cheap pets. I can get them for just a few pounds from the local pet shop. Right, so I also need a home to put them in. I know, I bet I can find something really cheap off the internet. Ah, there we go, that's quite cheap. Rats need height in their cage, and this cage is very tall, so this will be perfect for rats, right? And it won't take up much space. Right, so now I need some toys for the rat cage. What do rats need? They need um, a hammock, a climbing toy, a hide, and a water bottle. Yeah, that'll do. Okay, so this hammock is quite cheap, this'll do. Oh, it's so cute. It's the perfect size for rats. It would make a great rat hammock. These ladders are really cheap. Okay, cool, so there's our climbing toy sorted. Okay, so I've found the space pod that's really cheap. That can work as our hide. And what's the last thing they need? Oh yeah, a water bottle. This'll do, they only need one, it'll be fine. Most good rat cages are really expensive, and you're gonna need to fill them full of items, not just one or two essentials. The cost of this will probably be well over a hundred pounds. I don't really feel like taking the rats out right now. I'll do it another time. Okay, let's get the rats out now. Hello, girls. Hello, Piper. Oh, you're so cute. Hello. Hello, Cheerio. Hello. We're gonna get you out for free range now. Yeah, do you like that? Let's go up free range. Do you want me to, you want me to okay, you, you get on that. You wanna come out here? No, okay. Okay then, that's it for today. Back in you go, Piper. I let my rats out at least an hour every day and I spot clean every two days and I deep clean every week which takes about two and a half hours so they are very time consuming pets. Rats are really smart, so it'll be really easy to teach some tricks. You just have to show them the movement a few times and they'll get it straight away. Good job. They'll always find every trick really easy to do. Most rats have really short attention spans and some rats will get tricked straight away but quite a lot of them will take a lot of training to even do the lure so Piper has known how to spin for ages and I'm still having to reteach her here and she also keeps trying to steal the treats. Cheerio has decided she doesn't want to do this trick.
Rats are really cuddly animals and will always want to just stay with you and snuggle with you whenever you feel like it. They'll be really easy to pick up and handle and won't run away at all. <laughs> Rats will generally have to be tamed and hand tamed first before you can handle them and even if they do come already tame, um, they'll most likely be very high energy and probably won't want to sit still and snuggle with you right away. I don't really have a suitable video to go with this but the expectation is that the rats you can let the rats out for an hour every day and then when you put them back in they'll be ready to go back in and they'll just go to sleep and then when you come in in the mornings they'll be ready to play with you. Piper, do you want to come play with me? Come on, it's time to go back in the cage. So yeah, that's the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed it and please make sure to check out Live Laugh Birds' channel.